Hello everyone, this is Mark Flopsy Shepherd here, and here I am recording a poker game. There's significantly more of us this time. Will people stop beeping me in chat, seriously? No, I will not be drunk on video, Mobius. I don't know, do you think I'm drunk? <laughs> Still drinking beer now, so I'm getting more drunk. <laughs> Now I've got Ico two lots on my left, Insane Steve to his left, Namida to Insane Steve's left, Colorvalati to Namida's left, and Colorvalati to Mobius to Colorvalati's left. And folded. Yeah, I commented on this in the last tournament, but we start with 2,000 chips now. <laughs> I did comment on it, and Namida said he's increased the chip stacks. And here he comes, raising like a madman. Hmm. This is the first time Nico Two Lots play with us, anyway, so this will be interesting. This is also the first time Mobius has joined me in my uh, in one of my videos. Here comes a race from the media again. Oh, Lottie, will you shut up? Seriously. Hmm. And I haven't flopped much. He had auto check on, and so did he. <laughs> hmm. Tend to stick a bet in here, but I know with Colour Vlot he's in the hand, he's not going anywhere. Told ya. I can't play effective poker with Colour Vlot in the hand, seriously. What the hell was that, Colour Vlot? <laughs> Rats. <laughs> I beat his pocket sevens. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. I'm glad to have won a hand against him for a change because I wasn't having much luck the other time. Hmm, I think O2 lot seems to play pretty tight from what I've seen so far. Yeah, he hasn't played many hands. Yeah, don't even know why I called that Razor with Jack Nine personally. Making a lot of uh, bad judgment today. <sighs> then again, this is coming from someone who's drinking beer from a jug right now. <laughs> And the meter takes that hand. River Jack. Ooh, King Nine. I like this hand. It's not, and it doesn't. It doesn't mean I'm a Doctor Who fan because of K Nine. <laughs> Flop to nine. Impression he's gonna bet, yeah. Thought so. And he is the cause because he's colourful arty and he doesn't go away that easily. Ooh, it's getting a bit more interesting. The ten fall off now. Yeah, it's getting too expensive for my liking. And the board's too draw heavy. Wow, colourful arty folded as well. I'm sorry, but I've got to comment when he folds because that is truly an, that is truly an inspirational thing to see. Because when he folds, you know there's hope. There's no, you know there's hope in poker. <laughs> I 
Well, I keep talking about the last game, but Namida actually recorded that one, not me. He said he wasn't going to record this one, so I decided to record, record this for him. But I probably, actually, I probably will get this up to, I probably will get this up quite quickly, because um, I haven't got any other videos to upload at the moment. Wow. <laughs> Counterfeited two pair for insane Steve there, that's not very nice. That's worth calling that is. You've got good you got you got good pot odds there. Should have raised a bit more insane Steve to be honest, because um now everybody's got now everybody's priced into call. Ooh, nice flop there. Actually not such a nice flop because if a jack falls off, any king beats me. Although it wouldn't be bad if um a six came out. Yeah, I can see myself not getting a free card now. Yep, there we go. There's colourful eye. I wonder what he's betting. I want to see what colour plot he was betting with there now. <laughs> Call Mobius. You want to call him. Wow. That was a hero call from Mobius there. Actually. No. He had a decent hand there, you know. He was never folding there. Hmm. Could have lot. He's been crippled by that hand. He bet on the turn when he hit his four, didn't he? Yeah, that seems to make sense. So when he comes out betting, that's that that should that should turn danger signs out. I can just imagine Colour Flarty saying that as well. Full house, he's done. Nope. It's <laughs> with a 666 insane, Steve. I mean, you know, see, go two lots in his hand. Just going to show how much I'm paying the te I'm I'm paying attention. Sorry, I just like audacity to be in the background. Ooh, interesting. You could two lots all in now. Wow. Wow. He plays pocket aces really well there. All chat is disabled while players all in. Fuck off. I didn't know some was all in. <sighs> yeah, it looked like a lot of other people wanted to type messages there as well, because as soon as he all in was uh, all in was folded, um, I've had two messages come through at once then. Sorry about that, my mouse uh, cable is getting caught in my quilt again. <laughs> right, what's happened? Oh, Namida's raised. Alright, I'm out. Ooh, Echo 2 lots actually called though.
Oh, my foot is bleeding again. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, and my mouse is caught again. That shouldn't happen again now. Fuck off. So I wasn't what I wasn't anything, well I wasn't anything to do with what was happening in the game. Uh Queen Free, no. That's very nice of you to tell me that audacity. Disk space remaining for recording. 577 hours. I wonder if that's enough hours to record the rest of the Lemmings packs out there. <laughs> God, I'm getting some right shite hands today. Oh boy, Insane Steve's all in again. Someone's got to call him this time, surely. Yep, yeah, knew he would. So I see a Cthulhu and Mobius being the chip leaders for a change. Yeah, Cthulhu is a careful player, I can just see it. You know, the only hand I've seen him play in his pocket ace is the best hand in the game, pretty much. You can't check this down, Mobius. Ah, instant muck. Well, they both. What were they both playing then? Maybe it's had like Queen Free and a colourful idea. What the hell are they doing in that hand with that? Even I had a better hand than Colourful Art, he was 3 4. <laughs> it's gone down to 476 hours and 56 minutes now. <laughs> Must be going down live as as I'm recording. Uh, hmm. Meter and Mobius in this hand. Wow. <laughs> what the hell? The hell are those two hands doing? Doing battling it out. Uh, yeah, it's a very marginal hands. You know, hands I don't like playing. Colourful art, he's got virtually no chips left. Ooh. The hell in a minute, he's just giving him chips now. Thank you kindly, yeah. I'd expect that after pretty much just calling up chips off with uh, nothing. Oh, Mobius, be nice. Thank you. Hmm. Got a gut shot. Need a six for a straight. Not good if Echo 2 lot comes out better. Wow, over bet in the pot there. 480 into 300. No one's going to have odds to call there. I get it, you just want to cut off the pot because you had a king. Or you, you just sensed weakness, perhaps. What's the purpose of highlighting cards anyway? I'm not familiar with this feature. Pfft, 
don't normally play Queen 8, but then again, I was about to say this is this is anything could happen Thursday, but it's not Thursday, it's Sunday. It's not even Sunday now, it's Monday. Ooh, King Jack, I can play this. Watch the meter raise now. Yep, knew it. Bloody knew it. I'm not going to play it though. It's actually now got very good odds to call. Oh, yeah, there we go. Action killer for King Jack, an ace on the flop. And uh, aggressively abetting it in the meter, and a colourful arty that will not fold. Did you actually bet the amount of chips that Colourful Arty had in the meter? That's Colourful Arty out. There we go, I can stop complaining about him now. He's not a bad player, really. He's, he's gotten a lot better in recent games I've played. I managed to take a lot of chips off me in the last game if you watched that one. One more heart. No, no, I'm getting a bit short stacked now. Yeah, Ace Queen doesn't normally win. I hate Ace Queen myself in the meter. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Usually, when I play Ace Queen, you know, I hardly ever get it to show down. The only way I win the hand is by getting other everybody else to fold. Poop, I pressed the wrong button. What? I'm gonna get absolutely I'm getting absolutely poop hands I am. Steal Mobius's word. Kovlari knows how it feels. Now it feels how it feels in the last game I was in, because I was the first one out. <laughs> and not anybody was paying attention to what I was saying in chat either, because you get grey, you get grey chat instead of blue. Uh, see, I don't like that bet because he doesn't know what I have. I could have anything. I could have, I could have limped it with Jack Eight here. Let's see what happens if I call. Will he bet again? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna lay this down. Yeah, the media's on about something he posted on Facebook because I'm friends with him on Facebook. I'm not friends with many people from the Lemmings forums on Facebook. I'm only friends with Proxima and the media at the moment. I am open to adding more people on Facebook though from the Lemmings forums that they want to be my friends though. It's quite useful to have Namido on Facebook anyway because he has a lot he has he has quite an interest in poker and he, he tends to post a lot of his hands on Facebook and I like to look at them, you know, because it's interesting. And uh, we, we sometimes get into discussions about it as well. <laughs> so it's not like a it's not like a it's one of those friends who you just add and never interact with. <laughs> Cause I know people have a lot of those on their Facebook lists. <laughs> Mm, 
Ooh, that's a tough situation to be in. Wow. Big payday for Mobius there. Ugh, God, so I'm going to get absolute rags I am. I'm rooting for Mobius. Yeah, whatever the colour flop. You don't root for flops, eh? Yeah, I'm just going to stop burning chips here. See? If I limped, that Ico Tulot would have raised and then I couldn't call because I know he'd, he'd be playing something much better than I am. And the flop was absolute racks anyway. I had no premium hands. I find it pretty hard to play when I don't get premium hands. Oh wow. What are you doing calling the enemy, da? For God's sake, Mobius, why play if you're going to leave? Uh, A7, I'm going to shove that. Mobius will call because he wants to, he wants to lose chips. Watch. No? Okay. Hmm, I'm quite interested. I'm quite intrigued about the fact that I'm still in. Usually I'm playing with Namida and Colorful Artie and both of them have gone out. I'm playing with I'm playing with some relatively unknown players now. I forgot to say Mobius is sitting out now. He's te he's technically just he's technically just uh, giving us chips now. Whenever he's on a blind. Yeah, let's put a damper on the video. I hate I really hate it when I play real life tournaments and you know someone just gets a lot of chips and just sits on them and just goes and sits out. I tend to get that a lot in, you know, lower limit tournaments when in my experience. You get people just uh, getting an absolute ton of chips and then they just uh, sit out. But people wise up to this and they just start playing, you know, very passively and just let the blind circulate and let this person get absolute lose all the chips. So on one hand, you know, it's like I've got a lot of chips, I can't be asked to play the end game. This is odd dig at your Mobius, by the way. I'm just using it I'm just using the fact that you're sitting out as an example. Pocket two, that's an all in. Mobius is big blind as well, so there's only two people to get it through. If insane Steve calls here, he's probably got a 50-50 chance to beat me. Unless he's got a two in his hand also. Ooh. Come on, two more cards. One more. Yeah, I got it through. I rarely win with pocket twos. That's a first. Hmm, Jack Deuce. The media's commenting on my hand choices. You're too tight, Ico. This is gonna be this is gonna be dumb if me and Insane Steve bust out and Nico Two Lot is just gonna be raising every hand just to get Mobius's blinds in heads up in heads up scenario. 
Oh, the blinds have gone up again. Yeah, Moby's is getting blinded out rather quickly. He's lost about he's lost about ten percent of his stack already. That was with the, I was at the lower blind level. You had to be careful because Insane Steve called an all in. I don't know we call it now. I think he called with A7. Yeah, he called with A7. So, that's a very loose that's a very loose call. Given that he knows that I'm usually playing better hands than that. Mind you, there was an all in situation a, a couple of games ago where I. Uh, I reshoved really over the top of Insane Steve because he was blind. He was uh, he was he was blind on blind, and um, I reshoved really over the top of him with four free. <laughs> and uh, I think he had. He had a he had he had an ace hand I think, and uh, he ended up winning the hand. But the point is. Even if um No, he might have had a pocket pair actually. And you know, that would have me crushed. But even if I uh shoved back over the top of him, you know, there was fold equity. I mean if he called me with something like Ace King, I'd have a decent chance to beat him even with four three. It would like be Two to one to insane Steve in that situation still, but there's still a chance. It's better than having, it's better than having something like Ace Seven and getting called by Ace King. Yeah, that's a shove. <laughs> Six big blinds, King Queen, easy shove. Uh, Queen Jack. Uh, yeah. Shove fold mode. <laughs> Need to chip up because these guys have got way more chips than me. Hmm. I'll check and Ico will bet watch. Yep, he always does. You can have it. I think next time I'm in that situation, I'll just bet straight out even if I haven't got anything. See what happens. Yeah, it's not always about what cards you've got. <laughs> I'm very tempted to shove here. But it's, it's not worth it. I mean, I haven't played blind on blind with Ico too lot yet, so... It'd be better to have some better cards if I did it. Hmm, he folded to a small raise there. Ooh. No respect there. Ace Queen, watch everyone fold to me. Yeah, but I'm going all in here. Why are you even thinking about it? Oh my god, are you serious? I'll show my cards. <laughs> Just to show that I wasn't messing about. My cards aren't good enough to raise with, I don't think. <laughs> Nobody just comment and I'll show my cards. Saying that Ace Queen offsuit doesn't count, it's Ace Queen that never wins.
That was a bluff. Excuse me, don't mean to keep belching. I'm not sure that's the first time it's been caught on the caught on the commentary, but I don't know. So this, this game's lasting quite a while, isn't it? It's the 30 minute mark on the video now. Ooh. Nico's all in. Oh, <laughs> what the hell? I wish I could hit a flop like that with Ace King. Wow. Oh, thanks for playing anyway, kid. Too lot. <laughs> Didn't get to play a hand with you, but oh my god! Why would you shove all your eight thousand of your chips in? Yeah, I'm gonna be very, it's going to be very hard to win against the same Steve, because he, I think he is better than me. <laughs> I don't think we can play properly until Mobius goes now. Do that one as well. Yeah, Mobius is Mobius is running out of chips now. I'm not showing every premium hand I get because it gets a bit it gets a bit predictable otherwise. Okay, I think Mobius will be just about chipped out now. Nope, not quite. I think if someone's sitting out. They can't actually. They can't actually win a hand. You know, they'll just be. They'll just uh, automatically lose the hand. Thought so. Okay, well he's got about three and a half times the chip stack I have, but um I don't care. I'm just happy I made it to heads up to be honest. <laughs> At least he's playing properly now and just not not shoving all in every every other hand. Good grief, seriously. Why are the rags showing up at heads up, seriously? Better. I'll call that. <laughs> wow. It's going to be split pot, we know it. Keep them low, keep them low. I said keep them low. Thank you. My, my king play, my nine plays. Nice call, yeah. That was a nice call, actually. Mm. 
No. You're actually quite good short-handed. Uh, I don't know. It's quite rare I get complimented on my poker play, but I'll take it. This is where he shoves. No, okay. I don't know why he's complimenting my shorthanded play because I think my heads up play is absolutely quite weak. That's actually that's actually one of my worst aspects of poker. Heads up play. You need to be careful when you you need to be careful when you bet the flop because I'll check even if I hit. I'm check raising you like 50% of the time, probably. A7, that's an easy all in heads up. Especially when the blinds are getting as big as they are. Hmm. I don't know, I don't know. Every time I call his min raise, I miss the flop. What's going on? Just take it. I don't know why you didn't bet the flop, to be honest. <laughs> Come on, you can beat Ace King. No, of course I don't win against my own hand. Whenever I've got it, I never win. <sighs> Indeed, that was a good game. Right, well, I'm going to close this video off now. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time.